CompTIA ITF plus Complete Training Course. Exam Objective 2.1, Classify Common Types of Input and Output Device Interfaces. Electrical Signals. In this video, I would like to do some bonus teaching. While electrical signaling is not an official CompTIA ITF plus exam topic, it will help with your understanding of interfaces, especially, graphic interfaces. So what is an electrical signal? An electrical signal is when electricity is used to convey information. This is usually accomplished by manipulating the electrical property, voltage, up and down, as it travels across a medium, such as a copper wire. The most basic example of this, was sending Morse code across a wire, back in the day. As for the electrical signals themselves, there are two main types. Analog signals. And digital signals. An analog signal is a signal that produces a smooth and continuous curve. In this type of signal, the binary ones and zeros that we transmit are represented by the highs and lows of the signal voltage. Here is a visual example of an analog signal. Notice how the signal produces smooth and continuous upward and downward curves. Unlike analog signals, a digital signal represents data as a sequence of discrete values where binary ones and zeros are represented by the presence or non-presence of voltage. An upside to digital signals is that they support higher data throughputs. This is probably why digital signals have mostly replaced analog signals in present-day computing. Here is a visual example of a digital signal. We can see that the gradual increases and decreases in voltage are replaced with discrete values, causing the square corners you see in the signal. Great, now you know the basic difference between analog and digital signals. Now keep an eye out for analog and digital signals as we move forward with this exam objective. You are sure to see it again. Thank you for watching. Subscribe for more great content.